5 Daily Habits to Lower Cholesterol Naturally 1. Read those nutrition labels to avoid trans fats. You've probably heard this advice over and over again because it's one of the easiest things you can do to help control your diet, read nutrition labels. Nutrition labels can help you understand which good nutrients you're eating, and they can also help you avoid trans fats, one of the worst ingredients for your cholesterol levels. Trans fats, also known as hydrogenated oils or partially hydrogenated vegetable oil, are sneaky ingredients that may be good for food manufacturers, but they're not so good for you. Trans fats help make products last longer so they're easier to ship and store. They're common in many processed foods, and they're also present in many baked goods that use margarine or shortening. Unfortunately, they also contribute to raising bad LDL cholesterol levels, while reducing good HDL cholesterol levels. So if you really want to lower your cholesterol, read labels and try to avoid trans fats whenever you can. They're some of the biggest offenders when it comes to high cholesterol, and cutting them out of your diet can make a big impact. 2. Choose meats with fewer saturated fats, like fish or chicken. Refrigerator looking a bit emptier than usual? Before you head out to the store to restock, take a moment to review your shopping list and see if there's an opportunity to make some easy protein switches. For starters, Go easy on red meats. Many red meats are high in saturated fats, which can raise bad LDL cholesterol levels. For healthier alternatives, choose skinless chicken or skinless turkey more often, and avoid processed meats. You can also try working more fish into your diet. Fish is low in saturated fats, and many kinds contain omega-3 fatty acids which benefit your heart health and can boost your good HDL cholesterol levels. Here are some examples of types of fish you can try to include in your diet. Oily fish like Atlantic or Pacific salmon, Atlantic mackerel or tilapia. Shellfish like shrimp and crab. Freshwater fish like lake herring and trout. Saltwater whitefish like cod and grouper. Tuna steaks or fillets and canned light tuna. All that said, steak and hamburger can be hard to resist. When you're grilling out, choose leaner cuts of meat. Like anything, it's okay to have some saturated fats in your diet. You just need to eat them in moderation. 3. Get more soluble fiber with whole grain bread, kidney beans, quinoa and more. You probably know fiber as something that can help you with your digestive health. But if you thought fiber was only for digestion, think again, it can also help build your cardiovascular health. A low cholesterol food list is rich in soluble fiber, fiber that can dissolve into water. Soluble fiber grabs cholesterol in your gut, before it gets into your bloodstream, and helps lower bad LDL cholesterol levels. Foods rich in soluble fiber include whole grain bread, kidney beans. It's easy to build more of these types of foods into your diet. Try oatmeal and whole grain toast for breakfast, curried lentils for lunch, or turkey chili with kidney beans for dinner. But one thing that's important to remember here is that not all good foods are created equal. Generally, the more processed a grain or bin, the less likely it is to have healthy benefits and nutritional value. Whenever you can, try to stock up on fresh ingredients. 4. Boost unsaturated fats and fiber by snacking on fruits, vegetables and nuts. There's nothing wrong with grabbing a snack between meals to boost your energy or settle your rumbling stomach. 
but common snack foods like chips, microwavable popcorn, cookies, pastries or crackers are high in trans and saturated fats. On the other hand, snacking on fruits, vegetables and nuts not only helps you avoid bad fats, but also helps you get good fats and fiber. Raw nuts are high in unsaturated fats, which are the best kind of fats. Nuts are great for a heart-healthy diet because they raise your good HDL cholesterol levels and lower your bad LDL cholesterol levels. Other examples of foods that are high in unsaturated fat include avocados and olives. Nuts, along with many fruits and veggies, can also be a great source of soluble fiber. Adding as many of these foods as you can to your diet can be a double dose of cholesterol reducing impact. Not sure where to start? Here are some suggestions. Avocados Strawberries Blueberries As with meats and whole grains, remember that more processing means less benefit. For example, you won't get as much value from applesauce as you will from eating a whole apple. So, if you're able to, try to get raw fruits, veggies and nuts, unsalted if you can. 5. Embrace low-fat milk, cheese and yogurts. Choosing to lower your cholesterol doesn't mean you have to give up everything you enjoy. It's simply about making smarter choices. When it comes to dairy, this is a big area where picking a healthier alternative can be an easy win. For items like cheese, milk, cream and yogurt, use low-fat dairy products instead of the regular versions. If you're feeling experimental, try soy milk, too. Who knows? It could become your next craving. Making these changes is helpful because full-fat dairy products contain saturated fat as well as cholesterol. By picking a low-fat, or non-fat, version, you're building healthier levels of cholesterol in your bloodstream.